This is number four from the 2024 Algebra 1 EOC. Which graph best represents a quadratic function that has no real zeros? So whenever we're talking about zeros, this is just another fancy way of saying x-intercept. So what we want to see is some graph that does not cross or even touch the x-axis at all. So starting with letter A, we can see that the graph does not come close to touching or crossing the x-axis at all, right? So we know that it does not have any real zeros. It does not have any x-intercepts. So we're thinking that that's probably the right answer. Letter B has one x-intercept right at positive three. Letter C has two x-intercepts at negative one and positive one. And then letter D has one x-intercept right at zero. Okay, so B, C, and D all have what you would call real zeros. Letter A does not. So letter A is the correct answer.